let's get right to it. The data analyst is the only entry-level job I know of in the data space. However, it's become a top-tier role, like every other data role has. The salaries for data analysts are getting as big as those for data engineers and machine learning engineers. This does surprise me because the technical skills you need for a data analyst are far less than those of a machine learning engineer or a data engineer. Now, I'm assuming you know what a data analyst is. Most of you don't. A data analyst in the real world creates KPIs and dashboards and has great SQL skills. A data analyst doesn't use Python or R. They don't build machine learning models or any other nonsense. They build dashboards and KPIs. That's what they do. Check out this job I found recently. The top three skills are SQL, of course, Tableau, and GCP. Later down in the job description, they also have Power BI. Check out that salary. I've seen this more and more over the last few years. Now, you're thinking, this is great news, and it is. It means that all the data roles now command very high salaries. The bad news is that it creates a much more difficult barrier to entry. This means there's going to be more competition for these roles. However, as a general rule, this is great news for those who follow my channel. It means right now, every single data role commands a six-figure package after a few years of experience. It also means you should probably start taking the logic bot path to a career as a data analyst a little more seriously. Who knows, you might love the data analyst role. And with that kind of salary, it's one you can be in your entire career. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and have a great day. We'll see you soon.